This was the greatest night of my life. Seriously. I'll probably have to lie to people at some point and say it was my wedding day or the birth of my first child, but the three of us will know the truth. <laughs> Double overtime. Bulls win by two. Plus, they scored over 100 points, which means we all get free Chalupa! <laughs> I mean, it was a magical evening, right? I don't know how to thank you, Vince. Third row seats, and we got to go into the locker room after the game? Boy, some of those guys were swinging the sausage, huh? <laughs> Not that I was looking, but they were at eye level. <laughs> yeah, I thought that woman was going to eat a peanut out of my hand. <laughs> you know, dip down into the water bucket, wash it back. Elephant trunk, we got it a peanut. <laughs> well, I'm glad you boys had a good time. Maybe mention to your girlfriend that I'm not such a bad egg. Oh, she doesn't think you're a bad egg. She just thinks her mom's scraping the bottom of the barrel by dating you. Well, why? I treat Joyce like a queen. Hey, this isn't coming from me. It's just that Molly thinks your intentions are less than honorable. Look, I'm not going to lie to you. I've loved many women, but Joyce ain't like them other skinks. She's smart, she's funny, but she can match me kink for kink in the boudoir. I probably won't tell Molly about the kink part. She might not see it as the compliment you intended. Well, you know her better than I do. <laughs> so where to now, gents? The night is still young. Well, I should probably head home. Molly was pretty mad when I left. We can't go home now. We're drunk. We're in a limo. Hey, let's cruise past the nightclub with the windows down and tell everybody we're earth, wind, and fire. You're kidding. Do you remember? The 21st night of September Love was changing the minds of pretenders We're all chasing the clouds away Double, 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 double